Hi everybody, bit of an edge case scenario video here. In fact, quite a few of my videos are like that, aren't they? So, this video is for people who use a Shadow Cloud Gaming PC um, and you record your own voice um, and, you're trying to re and you're trying to record it at the same time as something on your Shadow Cloud Gaming PC, whether that be gameplay or you're doing a screencast or something, and you suffer from crackly um audio sometimes generally this is an indication of a poor internet connection um and what you'll find what you'll sometimes find is that audio records nicely and then you'll do a recording and it will just be crackly and you'll be like oh gosh and this is a way that you can kind of get around that um so normally what will happen is you'll have enable microphone ticked um and then you're normally say you're you know you're um your USB mic will will come through and then you can record that. But what has to happen is your USB mic has to come into your computer and then be streamed up to your shadow PC that's in the cloud and that has to be synced. And sometimes that can lead to crackly audio. So what we're going to do instead to get around that, this is what, what I do like every now and again, is we're actually going to record the audio on our own laptop and then we're going to sync it afterwards in the cloud on our on our cloud gaming on our cloud shadow pc so first thing you have to do is disable the microphone so don't have the microphone working the next thing you're gonna um gonna want to have is you're gonna have gonna want to have a copy of some sort of video editing software on your shadow cloud pc so what we have here is this is Sony Vegas 14. Now the reason why I've got this one on here is because if you um on the Steam sale this program goes cheap quite a lot. Now it's not great, it's a bit awkward to use if you're used to something like Premiere uh, Premiere Pro. Everything seems a little bit too complicated, but once you've watched a few tutorials it's a kind of similar sort of thing, you know, you've got your timelines along the bottom, bottom. But what this enables us to do is to import some video we've captured and import some audio we've captured. And then you can move them around and sync them up so you can then render them out and upload them. Now, to record the actual screenshot or the gameplay, what I recommend you do is use, use GeForce Experience, you know. So uh, it's Alt-Z, isn't it? Um, I use Control-Z. And, and you can set it up here you know, with, with your various settings. You're probably pretty familiar with this. So the idea is you can just hit um, Alt F9 and your Shadow Cloud will then, uh, Shadow Cloud PC will then start recording the video. Um, but what you want to do first, before you start all that, is you want to minimize your, um, uh, your Shadow uh, Cloud PC and kind of go to your ordinary desktop. And you want to have a couple of programs. You want to have Audacity. And I highly recommend the Levelator 2. So the Levelator 2 is a program that once you've recorded a WAV file, you just drop it onto the Levelator 2. And the Levelator 2 makes it louder, basically, and levels it all up. So it's a much better sound file. And what you're going to do is you're just going to make sure that Audacity has got your right input. So USB in this case. And you've just got to kind of be ready. So what, you, what you're going to do is you hit record on Audacity like that. And you'll say, you know, starting recording. Then you go over to your Shadow Cloud PC. And then you, you'll be talking. So you say, right, um, expanding Shadow Cloud, pressing that. Um, and then you'll be saying, right, pressing record now. So then you'll hit Alt F9 to start recording. And then you'll, you'll make your sync point. So your sync point will be something like... Um, Pressing calculator now, closing calculator now. And you do that, you, you have those nows, so that when you load the, the, the video and the audio, so so then, then you'll do all your talking, blah, 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 blah. blah, blah. And then, then when you're ready, when you finish, you'll press Alt F9 again. That'll save the recording. You make your shadow window smaller. Go back to Audacity. Stop that. And then you'll file... You'll export the file out. And then what you want to do then is you go into videos, you go into audio, and then basically you just drag your WAV file into the levelator and that will give you an audio output. Then you need to get that up to your Shadow Cloud PC. So you can either email it to yourself or you could use something like um, 
I use um, what do I use? I use uh, Google Drive Shadow. F so I use Google Drive. So I upload it to Google Drive one and then download it to the other. And once you've done that, and then you've downloaded it to your Shadow Cloud Gaming PC. Sorry, Shadow Cloud PC. Keep going, Gaming PC. You can then import both files into, say, Sony Vegas or Vegas as it's called now. And you remember that bit where I said um, closing calculator now. So that final now. You would find that on your timeline for your video and you would make a cut there and then you would find that uh, in your audio where i said now make a cut there then drag them both to the left so that's where they both start and then your audio will be synced up then you can export the video you know you can render it and then do whatever you want with it afterwards now i know this is a bit of a <laughs> it's a bit of a big walk around but some of these videos, some of these things that I do can take me sort of 10, 15, half an hour, some of these things. And there's nothing worse than recording a screencast for that long, whether that be gameplay or a tutorial or something like that. And then finding that there's crackly audio at the end of it. Generally, the screen tends to be all right because it's recording that locally in the cloud. But because the audio has to come from your mic here where you're sitting up through the Internet to the, to the cloud and then be recorded, that's where you get where you get the crackling from. So if this is if this is something you've got have a problem with, this video may well help. <laughs> if it has, I really hope. I hope there's other people who are doing this out there apart from me. Um, all this would obviously be sold if I was using a local PC, but unfortunately the Shadow Cloud PC does much better than this crappy old laptop. I say crappy, I don't mean that laptop, Acer laptop. You've done me very well over the last seven to eight years. You've done very very much. See, that's the problem I have. Unstable connection. Our internet where we live is just terrible. So you get that. So that's when you get the crackle. But hopefully that's been useful. If it has been, hit like. If you want to see more of the same, press subscribe. And I will, of course, see you again soon.